Hi, my name is David. Today we're going to do a JavaScript ES6 tutorial on free code camp. We're going to learn about the REST parameter. So the REST parameter, we'd use this as a way to create a variable number of arguments. And it's useful because these arguments are stored in an array that we can later access from later inside the function. So here's an example. We have a function that takes in how many and takes a REST parameter args and it wants us to return you have passed the length of this array arguments so for this example we're passing in zero one two which is three arguments so it's getting the length of it so we have three arguments and here we're passing to one two three four arguments so we pass through four arguments and the the rest parameter helps us apply javascript method to it for arrays such as map, filter, and reduce. So you don't have to turn the parameters into array later on as well if you need to use these methods. So for this exercise, it wants us to modify the function sum using the rest parameter in such a way that the function sum is able to take any number of arguments and return the sum. So let's look at what's going on here. So we're declaring our variable sum and it has a function. It is a function that takes an X, Y, and Z and is turning this parameter into a function and then is adding them all out, reducing them together and adding them starting from zero. So let me console log it so you can see an example, log sum, and let's take into account one, two, three. So it should add one, two, three, three. Now let's make a difference so that this is a variable amount. So we do parentheses dot, 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 args. Great. And now we don't need this anymore. And we can just do args. It says this is already array. It's taken to these account, and we uh, we would add them all together. And let me show you. That yeah, it's like that. Well, that's the what's in there, but it turns into array. But that'll be it for this one. Thank you so much.